Hello YouTube, this is Brewmaster H coming at you with another beer review and World of Tanks gameplay. Today we're covering Brown Eyed Squirrel by RJ Rockers Brewing Company. Uh, this is a 5.6% ABV brown ale in the English style. The overall aroma is really bready and kind of a uh, raisin smell. Uh, it's a clear reddish brown color with almost no head um, bubbling down to almost nothing at all. Uh, the flavor is bready with notes of raisin, caramel, and chocolate, and a pleasant bitterness. The mouthfeel, it's a medium-bodied beer with moderate carbonation. Overall, this is a good brown ale that's easy to drink and hits a nice medium between amber and pale ales and darker beers like a porter or a stout. Now let's get into some gameplay. Here we go. A Tier 5 game on Wide Park in the Panther 3-4. Now, we have got to warn you ahead of time. This game might be a little, uh, you know, a little tough to watch at times. It's got everything. A little suspense, a little insanity, a little how the heck can he get away with that. So we're going to go up, we're going to spot a little bit, we're going to try to get some, uh, use our speed and agility, and make sure that uh, the enemy team can't uh, do a whole lot for us. Fortunately, we're getting a lot of spots. And we're just going to try to take shots off the team. Oh, there we go. T-67 needed some. And there's our first bounce of the game. I didn't know it, but apparently the Panzer 3 4 has what may be the best armor at this second bounce of the game. Best armor at Tier 5 ever, I guess. I don't know. Um, probably a lie. Maybe I'm just the luckiest person alive. But check that out. So we got a few guys over here. We got a BT-7, a Bishop. We're going to try to take their artillery. Uh, no shots on the BT-7, so here we're going to try to get some spotting, and we missed. And this BT-7 is just going to sit in front of us. Not sure why. Doesn't fire, doesn't bother messing around, just sits there. So we'll take advantage of, you know, this guy. KV-1 off the side, no shots on him. Start turning, and there's our third bounce. What in the actual crap? Fourth bounce from an SDRV. I should be dead by now. I, I don't know how I'm alive, but I should totally be very, very dead. So I'm going to run back across, make another scouting run, make sure, see if I can get some shots into these guys. Use the ridge line, use my gun depression. There's a good shot and a fire. Loving it. Loving it. By the way, um, I didn't mention it, but uh, I was working on, on um, one of the medium tank missions for the T-28 prototype. And there's three kills. Oh my gosh. How how am I still alive? How has no one damaged me? I was working on one of the medium tank missions where myself and a platoon had to get up upwards of 4,000 damage. And I, I... That's why I platooned up with these two gentlemen who agreed to platoon up with me. Oh, there's our first damaging hit. KV-1. And no damage. No penetration. That kind of sucks. Ah, got the kill though. That's five. We're already almost at a top gun. Scores of six to three. I have five out of six. Oh, six to five now. I have five out of our six kills, however, and there's a Matilda four up there on the... Oh, artillery got him. Churchill, Panzer 4H, and KV-1S all down there. Artillery's trying to kill me. Panzer 4H, we need to get him dead, so... And we got our sixth kill. There's our top gun, but we're taking damage. Bishop, T-67, I don't think damaged us, but definitely uh, damaged our track. So fortunately, we didn't take any actual damage from the T-67 and that sneaky little turd. We've got an M8A1 over here we're working with. Just respotted the Bishop. I'm not sure if that was my spot or the M8A1s, but I'm trying to use all this cover that I can. And oddly enough, these guys are just going to let me shoot at them. They don't give a crap. T-67, boom, shot. M8, you know, don't want to contact them both, so... Oh, T-67 pushes out in front of me. We'll just track him and take care of that problem. And two shots in, M8A1 goes down, but we also lose our buddy. And last shot on the T-67. Well, what we thought would be the last shot. Unfortunately, we screwed that one up. So, moving shot. Bishop hits us. We know he's got a quick reload. So we're just going to try to flank him since he's very low, very slow about shooting. And now we're down to 12 to 9, but I only have 126 hit points left. And they still have a Churchill. Our 
Rubber Ducky ROI Experimental. Ooh, there's a nice little bounce off the T-56, or from the T-56, I should say. So we know he's still down in this area, not sure where, um, but I'm at seven kills now. Ooh, they've got, a, oh, their Churchill just went down. The Electo, I'm not sure what's going on with that guy. I'm trying to find this T-56, but apparently he's unspottable, like this dude. And he relocated, as we'll see in just a little bit. So we're coming down to the wire. I could cap. He's low tier. It's no big deal. I'm fast. But as you saw, he's got a decent gun. 110 average damage. or And I got lucky and bounced him. So I'm hoping maybe maybe I won't die. But I also kind of want the uh, the damage on him. And hopefully the Radley Walters medal. Eight kills. We're almost there. So this is where, our, where uh, TVs usually go to hot play hide and seek. We come over here, we spot him, auto-aim, no hit, no damage, and flank, oh, look at that, hit him and bounced off of him, shot him, we need a second shot, are we gonna, oh, lucky bounce, and there's the kill, that's the game, folks, let's go look at the, uh, at the scoreboard. So check this out. This result screen is ridiculous. It's just full of medals and information. Ace Tanker, a whole bunch of minor medals. We've got our Rod Radley Walters medal. We've got Spartan, Scout, Steel Wall, High Caliber, Top Gun. I mean, all sorts of spotting and damage and kills. This is just an insane game. Plus 6,845 XP earned with a 5X. Oh my gosh, what a great game. So here we go. 1,500 damage in a tier 5 against other tier 5s. 8 kills, 1,369 base XP. I just can't believe how this game went. That was so ridiculous. And that the luck of that final, you know, when I got tracked at the end, being tracked at the perfect angle to bounce that last shot. Just so fortunate. 27 shots fired. 20 hits, 18 pens. you got to remember, a lot of those shots were also on the move, although some of them were fully aimed and just didn't go where I wanted to. But decent ratio of hits to, hits to shots fired. 12 hits received, only 4 penetrated. 680 damage blocked by armor. I could have been killed twice over just because I got so lucky as to bounce a bunch of stuff. Nine vehicles initially spotted by me, nine damaged, eight destroyed, 750 assistance damage. I mean, this was ridiculous. I can't imagine. I mean, just look at this. If if I had had a premium account, it would have been it would have been even better. 41,000. Oh my gosh. I would I would have had such a great game. 10,000 XP is what I ever, would have earned for this with a premium account. So, that's the game. I really hope you guys enjoyed this. Please like, comment, subscribe and Enjoy the channel, guys. Have a nice one.